What's good, YouTube? This your boy, Mr. B from Backyard Barbecue. Cooking up any and everything, y'all. What's today's topic? Not topic. We cooking today, y'all. We gonna cook up some turkey wings. So, I ain't gonna even get into it. It's a quick meal. Uh, actually, it's not a quick meal. Uh, if you ever cooked turkey before, I don't mean the whole turkey. I'm talking about turkey wings, the drumsticks, or the legs, they call them. Takes a while because once it's done, you have to sear it a little bit just so you can uh, get that that nice skin. That skin on a turkey is kind of rubbery, so you want to crisp it up a little bit so it'll uh, make it tight and bite through. So stick with us, y'all. We're gonna go in this kitchen and do up some damage, y'all. Go ahead and season it up, and then come on out here and hook up on my Kamado and test it out. Right, first cook on the grill. I'm excited. Wanted to do brisket for y'all, but uh, due to some uh, malfunctions on my grill. Uh, when I put it together, I'm going to have to wait just because I want it to be complete. And if uh, if you're wondering what I'm talking about, go look at my other video on my new toy. And check that out and you'll see what I'm missing, right? Goes in details. Uh, got some fast speed on that when I'm doing the install or whatever. And it'll tell you about what I'm missing on there. But anyway, let's go to the kitchen. Alright, Backyard Barbecues, we are back. And I have turkey. That has already been cleaned out of my brine. If you uh, look back, you can do a search for brine or, the, or turkey brine under my uh, channel. You can see how to brine turkey. But simple. Like it's already uh, pretty much dry. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to use my handy dandy mustard. Remember the famous mustard? Yep. Shake it up because you don't want that initial uh, oil that's sitting on top to be in there. And all I'm doing is coating this, these turkeys. Light oil. I mean light mustard. On that note, when I said oil, you can use uh, olive oil too if you're concerned with the taste of turkey uh, tasting like mustard. And all I'm going to do is take this and just rub it with my hand. You don't have to use much because all it's going to use is a base to stick you know, stick your, your seasoning to. Sometimes I use oil just depends on how I feel, what I have in the kitchen because that's what this channel is all about. You know, not going out and spending too much money on uh, coming with, you know, buying products just to make a a decent meal for the family or for yourself. All right. Wash this off my hands real quick. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to come back with my handy dandy secret seasoning, y'all. Anybody know what this is? I'm going to go ahead and tell you because I asked this question before and nobody's guessed it yet. All it is is jerk seasoning. But this is my authentic jerk seasoning. Got to use it sparingly just because uh, I can't get it like I used to so and it comes straight from Jamaica y'all so all I'm gonna do is season this I'm gonna let it sit out for about 20 minutes while my uh, Kamado comes up to temp and then we're gonna put it on the grill y'all so I'm not gonna let you sit here and watch me season it you'll see how well this season uh, once I come back and get ready to put it on the grill so I'll see you at the grill in a minute alright back y'all barbecues we are back let me show you the temp I don't know if you can see for the glare. Uh, a little bit. About 250, maybe 260. Uh, we're going to go ahead and put this turkey on. And one of the things to note when they talk about lifting these lids is it's not really that hot right now. But still, you lift it up for maybe uh, two or three seconds to give it a gap before you introduce uh, or before you open it. So you see my pan right here. Actually, I need to put some water in there, but I'm going to go ahead and position my wings. Then I'm going to come back and pull, pull my uh, water in there. And I'm just going to sit these on here, y'all. Don't they look good? You see the seasoning? I'll get out of the way so you can see them here shortly. There you go. Voila. What I'm going to do is I'm going to hook this up. My Maverick. Let me wipe my hands real quick. I'm going to hook up my Maverick. Uh, so just so I can see the temps, man. Just see how, how well this thing maintains uh, its actual temperature since it's the first time firing it up. And then we're going to go from there. So, simple like that. Clipping. See my temp is already at 81 degrees. Hey, sorry about that. Uh, my temp's already at 201. See it's coming up. The temp. 
this is still actually went down. Remember what I told you when you put uh, cold meat on there, the temp will go down? Not to mention I opened the lid. But I got it set to uh, smoke in between smoke and grill. Got the bottom barely open. And we're going to see what happens, right? First cook, these wings. We'll be back, y'all, in about an hour. Just see what they look like. See y'all in a few. What's up, backyard barbecuers? Man, I made one of the simple mistakes, right? I forgot to put my wood chips in there. We got some hickory wood chunks. I'm about to throw in here real quick. Uh, with the help of my little sidekick, you done came over. Remember what I told you, you burp it, right? I can feel that heat coming out. We're gonna take the whole thing out real quick. Slide that over, that way it don't fall over. Put my wood chips in here. I'm only using three since I'm doing turkey. I'm gonna show you that real quick and I'm gonna put my uh, meat back on. Put one in the center. And then we're gonna go from there. This thing ain't burning slow as I don't know what. I might probably love this one. Oh, got the, yeah, there we go. There we go. Easy day. We all make mistakes, y'all. Hold my lid back. And they're going back to cooking. Anyway, we'll see y'all in about an hour and see what this final product look like, all right? All right, barbecue land. Uh, we about to see what's happening. I don't know if you can see that smoke. That's from them wood, them wood chunks that I, I finally put in there. It's going off, y'all, doing its thing. Once again, just a reminder about burping it. Look at them wings. Ooh, look at that. Yes, sir. That's going to be good right there. Mm-hmm. Anyway, I'm going to let this thing go and do its thing, man, for another hour. Actually, I'm probably going to flip them in 15 minutes. And then once it's done, uh, I'm going to show you the final product. Uh, we'll be back in a little bit. All right, y'all. We back for the final episode. Let's go ahead and crank this thing up. Ooh, woo. Let me get you a close-up of that. Man, that thing here smells something fierce. I'm going to spray them real quick with my uh, secret spray. And then uh, taking them off. Boy, these wings here. Yes, sir. Deep red color. Bitch, you wondering what's in my little bottle, huh? I ain't telling you. You can put in anything, anything in that. Uh, anything from beer to uh, cherry cola. Man, I'm looking good. Cherry Cola, you can do Dr. Pepper. Anything. There you have it. I'm gonna close this grill. I'll clean this off in a minute. How much coal I got now? I don't know. We're gonna see in a minute. Uh I'll be back. We're gonna show you how much coal is in here. We're gonna end this video, y'all. But first, we're gonna go in the kitchen so you can see what this looks like. All right, YouTube. Let's see. Let's see how much charcoal is in here. Let's sit that on top. Right, this thing ain't no joke, man. Hope y'all can see that. Still going. Let me close it. Put this back in. Y'all like my cheap, my cheap uh, ceramic plate? I got a video coming out on where you can get that from instead of paying fifty or something dollars for it. So bear with me. I'm gonna clean my grates off uh, while the heat's still going, and then close it on down and let it shut down to save my lump. Anyway, let's go in this kitchen, y'all. All right, barbecuers. I want y'all to see this, man. Ooh, 
Woo. Let me lift these up. Got that perfect skin on them. It's first time cooking on the Kamado, y'all. These things here, I'm going to let them cool. Mm, mm, mm. Um, I, I can't. I got to just take a bite. Just a nibble. Mm. Look how juicy that is. Let me see if we can get close on it. Hold on. Mm hmm. Mm. Man. Anyway, this is your boy, Mr. B from Backyard Barbecue. Cooking up some concoctions on the new Kamado ceramic grill. Thumbs up, y'all. Thumbs up. Can't wait to do more cooks. Actually, my next cook will probably be a brisket. So be on the lookout for that in the future, near future. And we're going to see what happened, y'all. Overnight cook. It stayed around 250. I would love for it to be 225, so I'm going to take it with it a little bit. But anyway, I still take 250. Anyway, this is your boy, Mr. B from Backyard Barbecue. Cooking up some turkey wings on the Kamado ceramic grill. Tastes awesome, by the way. And they, I know they're going to taste even better once they actually uh, cool off a little. And then go from there. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. And by the way, please share my videos, y'all. Four things. Like, comment, subscribe. Share my video. Share my video with all your other YouTube buddies or whatnot. You can even share it on Facebook. Twitter and all of the other social media that I'm not familiar with. Appreciate y'all looking. Time to go grow up.